Women all over the world are in love with him. Others despise him, blaming him for stealing their life savings. There are hundreds of Facebook profiles for Tristan Siegel. All fake. Facebook deletes some, then others pop up, and this has been going on for years. The final straw? The real Tristan was barred from his own Facebook page. And that's when he knew he'd better call Bankin. Investigator Shannon Bankin joins me now. I've never even heard of this happening. I haven't either. This is an amazing story. The real Tristan Sagal in the real world. He's a retired colonel from the U.S. Army in Wesley Chapel. He's happily married, but online his personal photos and likeness are being used in a lucrative romance scam. Here's a list of some of the fake profiles that come up. Every time retired U.S. Colonel Tristan Siegel checks Facebook, he finds more Found fake profiles of himself. That, that photo was taken of me in Australia. In, Scammers uh, hacked into his Facebook, stole photos, and created fake pages. Crooks pair these with dating website profiles to trick women into falling in love and eventually sending thousands of dollars to a fake Tristan. They basically are some scenario, I'm a soldier, I'm trapped in Syria somewhere, send money. Some victims sent as much as 10 grand before eventually tracking down the real Tristan. They're either very sad and genuinely heartbroken, or they're very, very angry and they call me a scammer and they want, want their money back, or they're simply matter of fact telling me, hey, there's this problem, I feel like a fool, I fell for it. One would think shutting down fake profiles of yourself would be as easy as alerting Facebook. Not the case. And Facebook has come back and said, we've reviewed it, it doesn't violate community standards, so we're leaving it in place. Scammers remained, but Tristan himself was kicked off Facebook. Fed up and desperate to get his identity back, he knew he'd better call Bankin before more people get hurt. It's, it's embarrassing and it's inconvenient that I'm locked out of my account and these, these fakes exist. But um, for others, this is a life-changing event. It is devastating. I've worked for weeks talking to Facebook and sending them examples of these fake profiles and I'm happy to report tonight that Tristan is back on Facebook. The saga continues though because Facebook deleted all those fake profiles but when I just checked there are many more that are right back online. That is so disturbing and distressing. I can't even believe it. I, like I said mm -hmm. I've never heard of it before. Why him? Are they targeting military members They're, or former military members? They are absolutely targeting military members and the U.S. Army has actually put out notice notifications trying to warn the public don't fall for this and he's not sure why him there's a lot of other people out there but he calls himself the Nigerian Prince of Facebook My you've heard goodness, of those yeah. scams yeah send money a lot of soon. profiles right yes all right thanks Shannon if you have a problem that needs solving better call Bankin the number is 1-855-BANKIN